What's happening? What's going down? It's your boy Robbie D. DKE TV, and we are in Manuel's Tavern, a film industry television mixer, with the man that gave it into conception. Mr. Jim Smith, what's up, brother? How you doing? Doing good tonight. Doing pretty good. What was your conception and, and why? Well, we started out, uh, a group of us were saying, look over here, there's some filmmakers over here. They're doing a great job. There's some over here that are doing a great job. They don't know each other, and we need to get them together and get them to make more films so I can act in them. That was the goal. There you go. So, so you're basically uh, your own selfish reasons. That's right. That's right. So, <laughs> so, so <laughs> no, I, I really went. I knew that there were a lot of good people and a lot of talent here in Atlanta. Exactly. And they just needed to hook up so that they could start making films instead of wishing that they were making films. Right. So, and how long have you been doing this? Uh, let's see. It was uh, about a year and a half ago. We started okay. about a year and a half ago, and the group has grown from the two of us that started it to what, what you saw tonight. It's uh, This is just the people to meet. We have hundreds of people, and we usually have like 60, 70 people each month that meet. So uh, it's it's been, I'm pretty proud of how well it's grown and the people that are connecting and, and actually seeing films get made. Yeah, And I'm actually glad and, and I'm proud of you for doing this, and it's something very viable not just to the community but to the whole industry within itself and you're also doing some some interesting things as far as getting these p particular people together as far as doing projects could you uh, kind of speak on that a little bit more yeah we've had um, a couple of screenings what we call one day screens one shit that time type one day shoot screenings uh, and what that is is our first film that we made that we had like 10 people and we said we have a script we have a camera let's make a film and so we could get a cast and crew for one day free and we made a short and we took time to do pre-production and post-production but we shot it in a day uh, so when the group started growing i said we we have enough people here we could get several groups to do that and then we could screen them uh, so we did our first one at push push theater and we had three films and i was hoping you know if we get 40 people this will be great we had almost 90 people there uh, so it was a big success. So we did it again in Clarkston, and we had two hours worth of films to show, and more people that were wanting to get them shown. Uh, so it's and Clarkston uh, loved it, and they want us to do it again. So we're going to be doing it again. It will have a one-day shoot screening, and so get out there, get a group of people together, make a film, and where you shoot it in one day, and we'll screen it. So, so is there any other specifications that someone would need to do as far as doing the short film? Uh, the only rules we have, we sort of, uh, because it's going to be shot in one day, it's going to end up being a short that's going to sort of confine you. Uh, we say try to keep it under 20 minutes. Uh, it's got to be R-rated or PG or better, no, no pornography uh, and no hate speech. And that is our only rules. So... Uh, because we want to see what you create and, and let you be creative. This is a fantastic baby that you've given birth to. How do you see it growing? Um, well, I'm hoping that the uh, the one-day shoots were also going to turn into more screenings. I'm talking with um, some of them at Clarkson uh, Community Center. Uh, they were very excited that we had the screening there, and they want us to do it more frequently. So I'm hoping that what we can see is having the people in our group get to see their stuff up on the screen uh, besides the one-day screen. Uh, we're going to keep doing the one-day shoots, but I, I want to see like more frequently us just get together and watch each other's films. That's fantastic, and I personally would like to thank you for doing this and for inviting DK Television. Well, I'm glad you were here. I think thank you for the publicity and uh, for also being part of the community. It's uh, all the people like you that are really making things happen in Atlanta, so I appreciate it. So tell us, how can someone get in contact with you? How can someone be a part of your mixers? Uh, go to our website. It is a tough website. It's filmend.meetup.com slash 33. That's F-I-L-M. I N D dot meetup, M E E T U P dot com slash 33. And you'll find our, our Film Atlanta meetup.com group. And you can join up, be a membership, post things on the board, uh, look for casting calls, look for crew calls, uh, tell people what you're looking for. Great, fantastic with networking. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Robbie D. DKE TV, shooting it back at you.